What's up everybody? Nick over here with FNR Kennels. So just want to give you guys a quick update on what's been going on. Um, I don't know, upload as much because I just work a lot and then family and then if I do have time I just kind of forget to just make a video and try to focus on the dogs when I do have that time extra. Um, but basically I'm trying to get the kennels ready for, for the winter. Um, to keep the rain off and anything like that from getting inside their house or their kennel inside um it doesn't get all muddy uh, i'm basically just made this roofing um nothing's nothing's nothing crazy just two by fours um right around the, the top of the kennel and then one two by four in the middle to help um to help down nail the the actual roofing that i'm using um I got this I got I got all this at the Lowe's so you could go and find everything there um, if you guys want to do something like that but um, it's just basically you know just just a little roofing to keep the to keep the the rain and whatnot off and, and it also gives shades you know um, I got I got rid of that tarp and all that um, and then I'm about to put a some black screen on this side on the outside of the kennel on the side and on the back over there that way they could have shade and then that way um air could come in and out out of out of the kennel um and then i want to put some i want to do like half pav pavers then half dirt um but i'll do that as well um so i'm just trying to get this kennel ready because i'm about to get another i need i'm, I'm looking for another another pup another male foundation to add into my yard uh um, because right now, like I said, I just have Chopper right here. Um, he's an awesome, awesome, awesome bully. But I want another one. I want another foundation mail. Um, but so basically, I'm looking for one. I'll, 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 as soon as I find it and buy it, I'll let you guys. I'll make a video of of him. That way, you guys could tell me what you guys think and let me know your thoughts on him. Um, hopefully, I can find one here in California because I ain't trying to go out outside of california because i like to the way i do it is i like to see my pup before i even buy it you know i don't send deposits or or i don't send i don't pay in full unless i have seen the dog already you know i don't mind going and checking out the dog and then leaving the deposit but i need to see it first i mean that's just how i do it um so but yeah um so i'll keep you guys as soon as i get him home or i find a pup i'll get him and then i'll I'll let you guys, I'll make a video off of them. And so basically that's what I'm trying to get the kennel ready for. And then I need to buy another kennel too, but that could wait because on another note, um, I have a, I already have locked in a pup on a breeding and that the female for that breeder, for that guy, he, um, she only dropped two pups. So for two of us didn't get a pup and two of us did and i was like fourth pick so i didn't get a pup so i got moved on to the next breeding so hopefully but the next breeding won't be till six months so hopefully by six months i'll be able to kind of get more more locked into it but i can't wait six months so that's why i need to get one right now and then once that six months come i'll just get a female off of him um because the deal was i would get a male but it doesn't really matter i could just be it could be a female or a male so if i get the male right now i'll just get the female once that breeding happens and, and those pops drop if everything goes well um but basically that's pretty much it those are the plans so far for the kennel i gotta finish building the roofing on this one up here well on these two actually but i'm just gonna do one by one as we go along and it's just basically continuing the framing that way till we just get to the end and then adding the the sheets the, the the sheets on the on top and then nailing them down pretty simple um something cheap um like i said you guys could find do the, find all that stuff at the home depot at the lowe's um and then uh, another important thing i want to get since i mean i'm already doing this video and i don't want to make too many videos my girl candy here candy she ended up taking so she ended up taking a walk from Chapo. Like I said, that's my only male right now. So I took him to Candy and then I took him to uh, to Cookie and then I took him to Candy. And Candy ended up taking. So hopefully I get some really good, nice pups. Last time Cookie brought out brought out five pups and Candy. Well, we just got to wait and see which, how much she brings out. 
um, but hopefully I'm looking but she she's she's already getting you know she it already notices um I just didn't I haven't made a video about it but she ended up taking um I didn't I didn't make a I didn't make a video about the breeding neither like I said I just been been back and forth and I kind of forget to make videos but um I'll, I'll, I'll keep trying to like I know I always say this on the video I'll keep trying to make more videos but I mean Nah, I forget to be honest. I just I just forget and when I do want to make a video sometimes I just don't feel it um, But she ended up taking um, I ain't gonna take no deposits until dogs are born and you know, like I said, I'm kind of old-school first come first serve um, That's pretty much how I sold my dogs last time off a of cookie and they ended up selling so But I mean off the bat on this breeding all the pups are gonna go 800 and up between 800 to a thousand, you know um so that's what I'm gonna try to sell them for, um, eight eight hundred to a thousand, um, no more than a thousand, but no less than eight hundred. Um, I might just do eight hundred all across the board, um, unless I see some. But I, I mean, if I do see something special off the breeding, like crazy or something, either way, I'm gonna keep a female off of this litter. I might even keep a male. I don't know, but I know I won't because I'm gonna be getting a male right now. But I'll keep a female off of this one. But she ended up taking. Candy, come on, girl, girl, good girl, girl. But yeah, and then uh, but yeah, um, just want to keep you guys updated. Um, as soon as it, it, when the pups drop and everything, like I said, from Candy, I'll make a video. Um, like I did last time with with Cookie, and I'll, and I'll try to keep you guys updated. I know it's a lot of information right now. You know the kennel setup. Um, I'm about to get another pup, and then I'm about to have some puppies drop from Candy around. Uh, late November or early December so I'll keep you guys posted on that but and then there's Chapo cookie then this so he's he's gonna be the dad Chapo's gonna be a dad again but yeah look at him keep you guys see his chest that cookie they like to be together man they they they're, they're they do well together but yeah let's keep you guys give you a good give you a good look of the dad of the pups and then that's the mom right there candy like i said she you could tell that she took awesome awesome about to be some pockets hopefully i get some really nice pie balls um pie ball is, is one of my favorite patterns so hopefully i do wish me luck guys and i'll keep you guys posted and like i said as soon as the pups drop i'll let you guys know um but i mean i, I won't i won't take deposits or i won't take anybody's money unless the pups are here and healthy um just in case you know anything could happen but i'll keep you guys posted but i'm about to wash wash the kennels um about to disinfect just um, I might well, want about to disinfect hers and then that one I kind of just spray it down with with some little bit of Clorox mixed with some water and it you know because they're just on dirt but but yeah I'm about to just want to make a video before I start washing them and letting them out um but thank you guys thanks for watching and I'll try to give you guys some more footage of them running around I know I haven't I don't I don't I usually I make the videos once they're in the kennel but I'll see if I can make some videos of them running around this week and that way you guys could check them out how they run how they walk how they act and how they interact with each other they all get pretty they, they all three of them get along pretty good like I always try to socialize your dogs with other dogs and and and, and people as well um but yeah and keep your dog safe in the winter from the summer from all you know from all kinds of weather um but thanks for watching uh this will this is a uh, fnr kennels and uh i'll see you guys later thanks